Hi everyone, my name is Sharon Pope and I'm a life coach, author, speaker, and radio host of the show, Tell the Truth with Sharon Pope. We've all been there. We've been in a relationship with someone that we cared about deeply. In my life, I've been hurt and I've also hurt others. I've had breakups where I was sad and lost and I've had others where I was mad as hell. When relationships end, and hearts are broken, it can be a painful place to exist. So we try to make sense of it, determining who was right and who was wrong and looking for some kind of closure. And most of the time, we just want to move on and bypass all the pain. We find ourselves not eating or sleeping or eating and sleeping too much. We easily lose focus and cry more than usual. And the dialogue in our head just gets louder and louder. We carry around with us this heavy load of anger, pain, and bitterness. We carry that in our hearts and in our minds, and some days we feel like we're just carrying around bricks. When your heart is broken, there's an opening, a small space for the light to get through. So when relationships break, we can either make the choice to shut down, not let that light in, sitting there in our anger and our pain, or we can turn our face towards the light. That light is the opportunity to put down the heavy bricks and choose peace instead. Not for them, for us, for yourself. Making the decision to be peaceful in the midst of heartbreak is a choice. Just like forgiveness is a choice. It's an action that you take to free yourself from the drama, the nonsense, and the bitterness. It's choosing to practice radical self-care when you're feeling down. It's saying yes to meeting up with friends, but not using that time to relive the past with your ex, but talk about your plans for the future. It's choosing compassion, at least for yourself, over animosity. And it's making the intentional choice to turn our face towards that light. If you're ready to think about your breakup in a new way, a way that is compassionate and powerful and transformative and absolutely possible, then join me for a free teleconference this Sunday night where you're going to learn the five questions to ask and answer for yourself that are going to transform the dynamic of your breakup and finally bring you peace. You can find out more about it at the Compassionate breakup.com. Until next time, God bless.